had my fro blowing in the breeze, sis. You feel me, big brother? You feel me? But yeah, it's it like it's about to rain. Why my husband ass ain't here so he can get these bags out this car? See, that's what I'm talking about. I got some collard green leaves because I saw a recipe on Pinterest that I really want to try, and it's collard green wraps. Be in a job or any type of situation where you're miserable and you do not want to do what you're doing every day. I know sometimes life happens and you have to. A lot of us are forced to do things that we do not want to do pertaining to money and jobs and careers and, you know, working for these businesses and building these other people's dreams and things like that. But for today, I let myself get some vitamin D from the sun and I've been coughing up some nasty stuff and I'm... Thursday, like June 29th. Y'all look crusty. And I know my voice sounds gross. I was feeling bad, y'all. Like, I just been feeling bad. So I had to go and see about myself and hence the bracelet. But everything is fine. I don't have like any kind of crazy, like, um, thing going on with me. Some sort of infection. That started with my throat itching like really bad. I thought it was just a throat itch, but it was much more. <laughs> uh, I'm just watching YouTube and it's like a five something. I don't know. I did start working from home last week, y'all. Um, was it last week? It's crazy. My head feels like I know it's big, beloved. Sis, I know my head is big a thousand times bigger than what it actually is. That's that's just the way it feels. I've been trying to rest my voice. My voice is coming back more so now, but just rising like I could barely talk at all. <coughs> but yeah, I started working from home. Last, working from home last week, and the transition is. I mean, it's okay. It's not like sorry if I'm crusty. Sorry if I'm crusty, y'all. <laughs> Pros and cons, like I say, with every job, you know, I don't think I'm ever truly gonna be happy on any job. But stepping stones, like I say, and like that's what's going on right now. That's our wedding table behind me. My hubby is at work. Today was actually a crazy day for him too, so I just wanted to check in with y'all because it has been probably like two weeks since I picked up this camera and hopefully this vlog isn't all over the place but yeah so I'm back working from home now y'all training is over um I actually still been uh, seeking certain things that would have me in an even better position than what I'm in now because I never become complacent I always strive for better for more so um I'm going to just rest up the rest of the day. I've had zero appetite. I got some fruit. I got some bananas, a grapefruit, and like a watermelon that's chopped up and maybe a little bit of cantaloupe left. I'm probably going to end up eating some sort of parfait or some kind of fruit bowl tonight because I just really cannot fathom eating anything heavy or anything that's going to make me feel just gross, even more gross than who I feel. So, y'all take care of yourselves. Wash your hands. Stay away from people as much as you can. And just, you know, stay hydrated. Take care of yourself. I'm going to check in back with y'all. If not, like, later today or tomorrow, then when I'm feeling a lot better. And um, thanks for being here. Let it go.
Check it out, you got me mesmerized. Family, so today is, yes, y'all. I had my fro blowing in the breeze, sis. You feel me, big brother? You feel me? But yeah, it's, it looks like it's about to rain for today. I let myself get some vitamin D from the sun. And I've been coughing up some nasty stuff and I'm a lot better overall. I'm not 100%, but I'm definitely at like, you know, 85, 90%. And I love that for me. Um, I had to run a few errands. I went to Whole Foods and then I went to Walmart to get some things for the week. It's Saturday. I don't know if I told y'all that, but it's, um, it's the first of the month. <laughs> it's the first of the month. Get up, get up. It's July 1st, y'all, and it's hot. But my skin is glowing. Why my husband ass ain't here so he can get these bags out of this car? See, that's what I'm talking about. I done got four, beloved. Like, I don't be wanting to carry no groceries or none of that. Like, Okay, y'all. It is so freaking hot. Like, I mean, yes, we need the power of rock to sustain us. <laughs> but y'all, like... Yeah, it's hot. It's like 95 degrees outside, but look. Oh, outfit check. It's, um, it's really like workout attire, but I like the way it looks with this little outfit, so I keep this on. I put my hair up. I had my hair out, y'all. It's just too hot. So, I'm going to do a quick little grocery haul for y'all, and then I'm going to chill out for a little bit. And I might be on shower number two for today because, look, food. I just got a few things from there, y'all, and it was like $14 and something, so, yeah. These items, not those, these items right here, this stuff was 14 bucks, but that's not bad because, yeah. So, I'll start with, I got some dinosaur kill, and this is the one that's like really, um, it's like this, y'all. It don't have like... The stems that go down the middle. They haven't had this kind of kale in a while, but I really like this kind. So, I always buy it from Whole Foods when I do eat it. I got some purple curly kale as well. Or is it red? I don't know. Either way, that's curly kale. Red kale. Let's, let's, let's get the exact name of it. Um... Well, look, it's kale. That's all that matters. And so then, y'all, I got some collard green leaves because I saw a recipe on Pinterest that I really want to try, and it's collard green wraps. So, yeah. <laughs> Excuse me, y'all. <clears throat> some broccoli microgreens, and I've been saying that I wanted to incorporate more greens into my diet, and I wanted to try microgreens and see how they make me feel. Um, yeah. I also got one kombucha. I got the mango coconut. Never had this kind before, but I'm excited to try it. That is all from Whole Foods. So moving on to the Walmart haul. I do not care for this personally, but <laughs> I got this for hubby because it's better than having sodas in the house. So yeah, this stuff just make you thirsty every time you drink it. But hey, who's judging? Um... Arizona kiwi strawberry. I got a jug of that and also some great value apple juice over here. My baby really loves um, the CPAC shrimp. His favorite is the popcorn shrimp, but y'all, I don't know what it is now, but people have been buying the hell out of them and they only had one of the butterfly shrimp left. I think they had like two of the coconut ones, but he don't like coconut shrimp. So got this for him. Also some fish sticks for, you know, quick, um, something quick for, you know, when I don't want to cook or if, you know, he just want to eat those. Got some Frosted Mini Wheats and Blueberry. This is my favorite, um, flavor of the Frosted Mini Wheats. 
for produce from Walmart, got some Angel Sweet Tomatoes. Y'all know I love these. My baby hates them. He does not like tomatoes. Got some avocados, four of the small baby ones, one red onion, and then I got one yellow onion. Two loaves of the white bread. I don't particularly care for white bread, but I needed to get some bread to put in this residence, so we got white. I will eat it, but it's not my first choice. I really like honey wheat or like um, grain bread. For dairy, which I said I was stopping dairy for a while, but look, got some cottage cheese, got some medium cheddar for salad, also got some sliced mild cheddar for sandwiches, got some eggs, y'all know the brown eggs are my favorite, but look, we just trying to survive right now, so we got these, got some steak fries, got a five pound bag of rusted potatoes, got a um, salmon filet. Y'all been really wanting to try to make um, salmon bites that I saw on TikTok. I don't know if that's what I'm going to do tonight, but I very well may. I very well may. So, yeah, got the salmon filet. And also got some whiting filets. And that's it, y'all. That's the grocery haul for today. Right now it's uh, 344. So, yeah, I'm about to put this stuff away. family today's friday <clears throat> it's july 14th and i have on my spectacles <laughs> nah y'all but i'm waiting for an eye exam so i'm sitting outside i just got here early um i had to work last night so i'm bright i'm chipper i'm here today is my bonus dad my stepdad and you know it's his solar return and he transitioned a couple of years ago if y'all remember if you've been with my channel for a while but yeah so it's a big friday i'm gonna pour some libations this evening and just really just celebrate we're gonna celebrate for more reasons than one and my husband is at work right now 
I'm sitting in this parking lot. I'm going to America's Best for the first time today. I've never been to America's Best, but we'll see how that goes. They have a crumble cookies over here. I have never tried crumble cookies. I actually am kind of intrigued by them a little bit, but I don't need no damn cookies, so I'm trying to suppress the urge. I'm also trying to suppress the urge to um to be out in these streets today shopping and spending money. So yeah, I just wanted to check in with y'all and I hope you all are taking care of yourselves and I hope you are blessed and living in gratitude every day. Um, message that has been on my spirit for a little minute now. Um, be who you are and not who the world wants you to be. Also, if you're in any type of job, career field, or you might be doing some type of even recreational activity or some sort of, um, you know, Y'all, whatever you're doing, if it's unsettling to your spirit, strive to get out of that and, and get balance and have that balance that you need and deserve for yourself because you don't ever want to live for other people and you never want to be in a job or any type of situation where you're miserable and you do not want to do what you're doing every day. I know sometimes life happens and you have to. A lot of us are forced to do things that we do not want to do pertaining to money and jobs and careers and, you know, working for these businesses and building these other people's dreams and things like that. But y'all <clears throat> keep striving that's all i can say because i'm constantly striving i know i talk to y'all a lot about jobs and business and things like that but y'all ultimately ultimately um i will never be completely happy working anybody's job um like I say, sometimes things happen in life and we have to put ourselves in these positions to be able to get to where we need to be, stepping stones. But, y'all, me, I will never be happy um, working in, at nobody's job. Life is life, and y'all. It's a lot of things that are changing in my life, um, things that have already changed that I've expressed to y'all, things that are still changing and Every day, every week, every month, every year is about growth and ascension and being better, being the best version of myself. So whatever comes along with that, that's what I'm doing with my life. That's what I'm doing. I'm going to see y'all.